From your weather authority, here's meteorologist Dan Ruff. Hey, welcome back here. Thanks for choosing Fox 66 News. A nice night, mild and still muggy out there. As a look out at the HumesforCars.com sky cam at the bayfront. And uh, this dog here was definitely keeping cool today with those hot temperatures. This is from Jackie Wyant in Erie, Pennsylvania. Um, so had the right idea there. Definitely uh, keeping on the cool side with those very warm temperatures. No precipitation here. And we're going to stay dry for the night. You can see most of the activities over here towards the west in Wisconsin. And that won't quite make it over here. Here until we head into the week. Weather watcher temperatures we have 70s, 81 degrees still in McCain. And uh, for the south here, Youngsville 76, Chandler's Valley 72, still measuring, uh, still have 80 degrees in Conneaut Lake. And your dew points on the muggy side. And we're going to remain muggy for actually quite some time. Winds right now on the lighter side for us with the high pressure over our area. Almanac numbers today. We did not hit the record, but we had 89 degrees, record being 92, and the low temperature of 74. So we're going to continue with the heat for this coming week and into the 4th of July. With humidity, it's going to probably feel closer to around 100 degrees for tomorrow again. So you want to check the pets, the elderly, and the kids, and make sure you stay hydrated and limit the outdoor activities and take breaks when you can. Rain chances look pretty small, but they are there. We'll take a look at that in your seven days soon here. But your lake forecast for tomorrow will have 60 degrees for your water temperature, winds south 10 knots or less, and your waves two feet or less. And basically, we have this big high pressure system keeping this precipitation out of here. Eventually, this will start to sneak into the area for Monday, but for now, we're going to just going to stay hot and dry and muggy. For tomorrow, we'll have hot temperatures, but the worst of it will be off towards the east where they could be approaching temperatures around 100 degrees and that's without the humidity and basically you have this high pressure kind of just keeping the air trapped um, over us and not allowing for it to escape by any means and keeping us uh, with those 90 degree temperatures. So for tonight, here's your forecast, 74 degrees, very mild here, 70 inland and 63 for the mountains, clear, mild and winds about south 5 to 10 miles per hour. For tomorrow, might even be approaching our record temperatures here. 94 degrees for the lake shore, 95 for high for inland and mountains, 93, mostly sunny skies and winds south about 5 to 15 miles per hour. And tomorrow night, well, you guessed it, it's going to be mild again here. Temperatures in the 70s and the mid 60s, winds south about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Let's take a look at that seven day forecast for you. Showers and storms will be possible on Monday with that cold front starting to approach our region there. A chance on Tuesday for 4th of July. We'll have a chance of showers and storms. Still pretty low, but you know, it's there. 91 remaining hot into Thursday, and then showers and storms possible on Friday at 87. We'll have that cold front move through and finally bring down our dew point sunny skies on Saturday at 80. Find that seven day forecast, all your sky cams. Check it out on your eerie.com. Had the right information there, checking on the elderly and the pets tomorrow. Yes, stay cool, take care of yourself and others. Best thing you can do. Got it. We'll be right back, folks. Don't go away.